Welcome to today's daily message. Today I'm continuing my reflection on Pope Francis's encyclical Laudato Si, which concerns uh, care for our earth and our environment. In number 10 of the encyclical, Pope Francis calls attention to the great patron saint of ecology and environmentalism, Saint Francis of Assisi. Saint Francis was a man who was deeply concerned about the earth, deeply concerned about the poor, and who tied love of God to love of the poor and love of nature. And so on the very bottom of this, of the screen, you will see the four aspects of St. Francis's ministry that Pope Francis wishes to call attention to. I'll read that last sentence. It says, he, St. Francis, shows us just how inseparable is the bond between concern for nature, justice for the poor, commitment to society, and interior peace. Let me say something about each one of those. When Pope Francis talks about St. Francis's concern for nature, he uh, was talking about the fact that Francis believed that nature is a tremendous gift of God and that we as human beings are one with nature. We cannot remove ourselves from the environment in which we, in which we live. We are truly one with all of God's creation. Justice for the poor. Francis understood, both Francis's understood and understand that it is the poor who are hurt the most by climate change, by our wastefulness, by our waste of energy. And so uh, St. Francis and Pope Francis both uh, call attention to the need for justice for the poor, that the poor have a right to a cleaner uh, environment, a cleaner, healthier environment. Commitment to society. What that means is that our love of neighbor, our commitment to love each other is deeply involved with and connected with our commitment to uh, the environment, that we cannot separate love of neighbor and love of the environment. And finally, interior peace that if we are to be one with God, then we must also be one with the natural earth. If we are one with God, one with ourselves, one with each other in society, then we must also be at peace and one with the physical environment in which we live. Once again, thank you for 